Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to some more RimWorld. This is going to be Season 2, Episode 1. Let us begin. We're going to do another Crash Landed. This is the classic RimWorld experience. We're going to do some challenge instead of rough. Some challenge for players on their first game or casual players who still want to challenge. Threats are dangerous but not brutal. I kind of like that because the thing is, it's not necessarily the raids or the animal attacks that make this game hard. It's the constant mental threshold breaks. Holy crap is a pain in the ass. So I'm going to let lessen up a little bit on the raids and such and focus more on just trying to make sure everybody doesn't lose their freaking mind every two seconds. That's really the big thing. Um, let's pick a name here. Murderous. Perfect. All right. Come here. Uh, and we'll do 300 by 225. Seems seems good enough. All right. And what kind of place do we want? This over here is kind of trippy looking. Oh, it's year round. I don't want to do year round either. Growing period wise. Like close to that, maybe. 11th of winter, 1st of winter. It's basically all year round. Um, 1st of spring, 11th of fall. That seems pretty legit, time wise. 7.5, 6.4 rainfall. Marble slate. More rainfall here. Yeah, let's go with this one. Select site. All right. We are only going to take people that are capable of everything. First things first. You have a torso a scratch car. No big deal. You're a medicine. You have high medicine. You are my doctor. All right. I want somebody who's really good at shooting too. All right. You're capable of none, but you're also... Uh... Yeah. Social, dumb labor, intellectual. Intellectual might be one that's okay. Skilled labor? Hell no. Um, intellectual might be okay on the idea that, wow, you just, you're just really bad at everything, though. Um, where, you know, as long as one person can do researching, who cares? Dumb labor? No. See, I, this is a really good character, too. But the no to dumb labor. That's dumb. I'm not... I'm not getting anybody that can't haul, you know? You're capable of none. You're 70. You're frail. No, that's not a thing. Hauling, mining. It's really hard to get anybody to, like, be decent. Capable of none. You do heavy amounts of research and medicine. You're an entrepreneur as well, basically. You're just a worse version of Marina. Grunt. Incapable of scary. That's that's firefighting, right? Is, is scary firefighting? It doesn't tell me. But you're capable of shooting, aren't you? That's um, that's something else. You have really good stats. Like, really good. All right, let's try that. Yeah, violent is the one where you can't fight. You're a vet. Hmm. No. Uh, a gr another grunt. God, your stats are really high, dude. You're almost, f you're 62 years old. You can't do construction or mining. But you can do everything. I kind of want to get rid of her just on the fact that she's 62. Because I'm just really concerned about her being frail at some point. You have a psych height addiction. All right. As if the, you know, as if the game wasn't hard enough, I don't need somebody who has an addiction issue and, like, is constantly freaking out every time. You have asthma. That sucks. I actually have asthma, or at least did when I was younger. It's not so much a problem anymore. And it sucks. <laughs> it's a real pain in the butt. You're a miner. Holy crap, your melee is really high. Creepy breathing. People find it creepy. And <laughs> Texane breathes heavily all the time and sweats constantly. Maybe he's just really anxious. Uh, you're a prostophobe. All right. You're neurotic. That's okay. You work real fast. So you have a little higher threshold. You're heat lover. All right. Prostophobe, another one. You're both prostophobes, yeah. Lazy. That sucks. I don't like lazy at all. No. God, I just, it's really hard to get decent characters. 
Dislikes men and trigger happy. You shoot faster, but you have really terrible aim. Uh, no. An herbalist. No. I'm going to spend a decent amount of time on this because this actually matters to me. After the last whole BS thing that happened, I kind of want to make sure people are good and can do everything and you're a brawler. Okay, well that's fine. We need at least like one person. You're also a grower and everything. You're a miner, so you do a really good at mining. You're also really good with melee and shooting. And then you have really high, like tons and tons of, of passion for everything. But you're really good with medicine and research. I think this is a good setup. We got Marina, Texane, and Leaf. Okay. Works for me. All right, and we are up in the mountains once more. Sorry that took a little long, a little while, but I want to make sure, you know, I had at least had a decent start. Wow, three of these right here. Boom, boom, boom. Four. I almost want to just close this whole thing off like that and just have this whole thing. In fact, I might actually just do that. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to do that. I like the idea of that. So what I'm going to do is let's first claim this and this and that and this. Deconstruct these and that. Yeah. And this. Right? And <clears throat> we'll claim these as well. And then deconstruct them. I want all the bricks. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, then we'll do a growing zone. Like right here. And we'll, we'll grow a couple of different foods as well as... Oh, there we go. Um, this last one will be for for health. Uh, heel root. We'll do heel root on that one. Um, strawberries on this one. And... I just just corn, maybe. Nutrition point three. Holy crap, these actually all have numbers. Point two, okay. Rice. Point one eight. All right, real low. Corn seems to be a really good one. Yeah, get corn. So we got corn, strawberries, and heel root. All right. Also, let's unforbid everything. I'm just going to do this all nice and early on. Check character. You're a good shot. Yep. You're also really good at melee, but she is, or, uh, yeah, Varky is a brawler, so. And you're not very good at either, so you're going to take that. Um, we have a cat named Walter. <laughs> All right. I like Walter. Uh, it's, it's so weird when people, like, when people name their animals, at, like, human names. Like, yeah, this is my, my dog, Bob. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> whatever floats your boat. All right, we're going to grab all of these these walls, basically. I, I just want to claim all of it, deconstruct them. And um, I'm also going to leave this with the check marks. But yeah, I'm going to I'm going to deconstruct them all and um, use them for other things for um for building the walls. This is kind of my plan. That's what I want to do. All right, so you're doing that. What are you doing? You're wandering. Who hunts? Texane does. You know what? I'm going to make you hunt. And you're going to hunt this turkey because it's harmless. Hunt the harmless turkey. All right, we'll let things go on two speed for now. I don't want to move too quickly. This will help you develop your shooting skills as well. Plus, you have a pistol, so I don't feel too worried about you shooting somebody's face off. I really wish the turkey would stop going towards leaf. I could see Leaf getting shot by accident. Okay, you know what? It's really annoying that the turkey is going to go this direction. Oh, he killed it. Oh, good shot. I was really concerned that you were going to just shoot him in the face. All right, hunt that rabbit. Rabbit. <laughs> Rat, rather. 
Okay, don't go in front. There we go. Now, what I'm going to do is have them build... Um, a butcher table. Where do I want to put this? We could do, like... This could be, like, power and, and other, like... You know, other resources of that sort. This can be, like, where the, the growing and food is. And I can maybe put the houses and stuff inside. That'd be kind of cool. For now, just put this up here. And then a... Um, field stove right there. That's where we're going to do the start. You're also going to be ordered to chop trees, chop all those trees. Cool beans. Texane's working on removing all these walls. Getting some bricks out of them. I also have these being dismantled too. I think they drop... Uh, yeah, steel and components. That's good. Already growing. Marina, what are you doing? So what What are you not doing for uh, construct? What are you not doing for? Nice. Nice English. Um, construct and repair. Yeah, go do some construction. Even if it takes you a little while. Do something. Um, work on that blueprint. For the butcher's table. So that those don't rot. I don't have a place to put food yet, but for now, that'll work. All right, uh, and then build that stove. Marina failed while constructing the stove. Some resources have been wasted. Oh well, it's gonna happen. All right, now you're deconstructing a ship chunk. That's fine. So far, decent. Um, and I think we'll put some beds down. We'll put uh, a couple of sleeping spots maybe over here, just out of the way for now. Just line them right here as we need them. Probably wouldn't be a terrible idea to build like a, uh, a little room for, uh, for prisoners right now too. Yeah, I think we'll build like a big old, big old nine by nine room, just over here, with the door, and that'll be that'll be a prisoner room. Ooh, some steel, nice. Got lots of steel, for now, <laughs> for now. We're gonna have some wood too as we collect this stuff as well. Um, I need to set up a bill. To butcher creatures forever. And also, um, make kibble. Do until you have a uh, 10, sure. <clears throat> Turn some of it into kibble for the animal. Oh, little kitty meow. Walter. I love that. I love the idea that the cat's name's Walter. Um, hunt this hair as well. Don't shoot anybody in the process. Good. All right, you go back to deconstructing. Um, so what kind of walls do I have? Or what kind of walls can I build, rather? Oh, you know what? I don't have a, a zone for a stockpile. Let's put a stockpile just right in the middle here. I'm not going to be too worried about how everything looks yet. I'm just going to make sure everybody's okay. Um, let's make this from here. Yeah. Here over... Do all of this. All of this is going to be home area. Right? And then from here. Yeah, from like here over. It's going to be all home area as well. It's probably a little excessive, but I'm going to. This is basically going to be my, my area. This is the area that I'm going to spend my, my time in. Everything else is, is just outside of my home. I, it's like a third of the map, but, you know, <laughs> I like having the space. <laughs> and we'll build walls along here and here. We'll close this up and then over here. And this will be all mine. It's going to be nice.
Sorry you guys don't have room still. I mean, for now, I guess, I guess for now, just to make sure that everybody, nobody loses their mind. Um, we'll build, uh, we'll put some rooms here. Holy crap, these rooms are big. Ah, uh, no. We won't bake them that big. We'll do five by five. Yeah. Two, two, two. That's a lot better. There we go. And some doors. Whoops. That'll work for now. I'll, I'll, I'll double you guys up in, in rooms as well. You guys will get uh, two beds, two beds per room, for now. That'll hold us off for a while. There we go. What's going on? Need defenses? Yeah, you've been here some time. Pirate raids will start soon. You should prepare defenses, whether they're traps, sandbags, or turrets. Yeah, I mean, I have the steel for sandbags. But I don't have, like, a, a place that they're going to funnel to, so it's not much point yet. And I don't know how many blocks I have just yet, so it's going to be a while before I figure that out. Chuck a spacecraft has fallen and landed nearby. All right. Oh, wow. Hi. Um, yeah, you can struck those. Go for it. I need to do something for Joy as well. Let's uh, build a horseshoe pin. We'll just build it over here. For now. All right, uh, fuel stove. Cook simple meals. Do until you have 10. That's fine. Um, who's the cook? Texane the miner is the cook. Also, the animal handler. All right. All right. What's what's Texane doing? You're deconstructing still. Um. Okay. So you do construction before. You should be healing. Uh, taking care of this. Area has been revealed. Well, I already knew it was just a tiny room. I mean, that's not surprising to me. Um. You should be cooking before. That though. Cook. Go cook, sir. Go put fuel in it as well. Oh, there's already fuel in it. Good. All right, make some food. We have a visitor. He seems to have a few items to trade. Blackjack. All right. Carrying a shoddy pistol with him. Good old Blackjack and the shoddy pistol. That could be a band name. Blackjack and the shoddy pistols. <laughs> that definitely sounds like an old punk band. All right, who's the uh, who's the talker? Marina. As much as I like you deconstructing that, talk to Blackjack for me. All right, what do you have, sir? You have packaged survival meals for quite a bit. Might be worth getting them. You have medicine, too. Yeah, I'm gonna grab both of those. Um, I could trade you some components. I don't need the components. I wanted the survival meals. There we go. Goof that up. Um, That's fine. I'll lose a little bit of money, but I'll get things that I actually do need, like survival meals and medicine. That's good. Very good. And we have some more components here as well, actually. So we're doing good on components for the time being, which makes me think, you know what? Let's trade some components. I have 78 of them right now, so... We'll trade off 18. That's more than I had to start. Thank you. And we basically got our money back. He's still cooking. Good. Good things. Where do we where do we get all these berries? Did we just Wow, we already got a harvest of berries? That was fast. That was real fast. Minor break risk. Texane. How come? 
How come? What's wrong, sir? Uh, you are urgently hungry. You are cooking. You are literally cooking food right in front of you. Why don't you eat, man? Eat the food. No, 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 no. See, what you're gonna do is you're gonna consume a meal. Yeah, see, that's what happens when you're hungry. You just eat. You're also rebuffed by Marina, so you guys don't get along, huh? Let's check your social. No, you guys get along. Why were you rebuff? You had a nice chat, had a deep talk, attempted to remove... Oh, you, re you were rejected by Marina. Oh, poor guy. You had a nice chat with her, though. You guys are good friends. Real good friends. All right, you're leaving. Take it easy, Blackjack. Take it easy. All right, well, that's going to do it for the first episode, season two. We got some food. We got some rooms start to set up. We got some prisoner beds. Well, getting ready. We're already making some food, so we're doing okay. We got all these. Well, oh, that's steel. Nice. We got all these sandstone blocks and various blocks that I'm going to use to try and build up the wall. It's going to be ugly. The reason why is because it's going to be built all out of all different kinds of blocks. It's going to be all different colors. I'll fix it later as I break down sandstone, which is all around me, and maybe make it all sandstone or something. There's also some granite down here. Um, and then make it pretty. But for now, it's just block everybody off and, and with something that's not very flammable. I'm pretty sure stone walls are not flammable. 0% um, flammability. Yeah. So, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider hitting the like button and uh, subscribe to keep up with the series as well as check out the channel. See, uh, see if there's something you like. I do a little bit of variety of everything, so hopefully there's something there for you. But, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. I've been Chaotic Order, and I will see you next time.